Have you ever wished you could eliminate the need to select the perfect settings at the time of the shot and have multiple options to choose from later? Welcome to the wonderful world of bracketing. Bracketing gives you the ability to apply varying settings automatically over a series of shots. How does it work? The best way is to show you. Let's go to Nathan in the photo studio. Thanks Paige. There are six types of bracketing options available and today we're going to talk about focus bracketing. It's important to note that you should not use focus bracketing for moving subjects. Focus bracketing involves compositing, and in order to do this, each image must register perfectly. Even the slightest movement will prevent you from making a great composite with large depth of field. The ideal subject for focus bracketing, still life and macro photography. And that's exactly what I've set up here in the photo studio. Bracketing cannot be engaged while in iAuto, so I'm turning the mode dial to manual, but it can be used in P, A, S, or M. To enable focus bracketing, press the menu button. Scroll to camera two, navigate to bracketing, and click OK. From there, select on, and select the type of bracketing you want to use from the six options. AE, for exposure bracketing, white balance bracketing, flash bracketing, ISO bracketing, art filter bracketing, focus bracketing. It's important to note that focus bracketing is the only option that requires compositing. All other bracketing modes result in multiple images to allow you to choose the best one. To select focus bracketing mode, press OK, and then the right arrow. Finally, select the number of frames you want to shoot from 3 to 999, Set the focus differential between 1 and 10, and then press the shutter halfway to exit the menu. You'll notice that I put the camera on a tripod, which often provides the best results. Now I'm able to frame my subject and focus on the nearest point to the lens, and fully depress the shutter release. The camera takes the pre-programmed number of exposures from the nearest focus point to infinity. Later on, I will composite the photos on my computer using Helicon Focus and Photoshop to create one image with tremendous depth of field at any aperture. Think of the possibilities and the flexibility that bracketing provides to photographers. Not just with focusing, but with exposure, white balance, art filters, and more. That's the power that bracketing gives you. If you want more detailed instructions on this or any of the powerful capabilities of Olympus interchangeable lens cameras, visit getolympus.com. We'll see you next time.